First, the fast version. They're usually the moves that teleport you back to the original location you used the auto dodge. They also give you a speed boost. Second, the slow version. They don't give you a speed boost, unlike the previous type. But your duration of iframes is higher than the fast version. Though, you can get staggered by M1S. The fast version is unable to be staggered, but some people would rather use the slow version. Actually, there are only two moves of slow version in the fast version. Move that the slow version was created when this update was released. AKA, Taijutsu Body Dodge. Taijutsu Body Dodge can be equipped in all slots, so you're able to equip more bloodlines in your move set. Either way, Let's try to counter either of them. Here's solution one. Applies to both versions. You simply bait the guy's auto dodge by guard breaking or stunning him. When he uses the auto dodge, you back off and try to combo start again. You can use moves that are not necessarily a guard break, but something that you can punish the opponent. Solution two applies to both versions. If the target still didn't use his auto dodge and delayed on purpose or the auto dodge is still on cooldown, do an M1 combo, then use a grab move that has really long animation. Solution 3 applies to the slow version. If you stun the target and he happens to be near you when he used the auto dodge, wait for the stun effect to come off. Then M1 when your stun is about to end and stagger the target until his auto dodge runs out. Solution 4 applies to both versions. Prevent the target from using auto dodge at all long. If the target cooldown isn't ready yet but goes off in 10 seconds, you do a quick high damage move before doing an M1 combo package. 